Hello my friends, welcome to Top Classical Music. Today we will present a short biography about Edward Elgar. Edward Elgar was a renowned British composer whose musical genius left an indelible mark on the world of classical music. Born in the small town of Broadheath, Worcestershire, England, Elgar showed early promise as a musician, self-taught on the piano and violin from a young age. Despite his lack of formal training, his talent and passion for music led him to compose his first original works while still a teenager. Elgar's breakthrough came in 1899 when he composed the Enigma Variations, a series of musical portraits representing his friends and family, with a mysterious unifying theme that has puzzled musicologists and enthusiasts for generations. The piece catapulted him to international fame, establishing him as one of the leading composers of his time. He continued to produce masterpieces that showcased his unique style, drawing inspiration from both the British countryside and the German Romantic tradition. His compositions, including orchestral works, choral pieces, and chamber music, are celebrated for their emotional depth, rich harmonies, and evocative melodies. In 1901, Elgar composed what would become one of the most recognizable works in the classical repertoire, the Pomp and Circumstance Marches. The first march, with its triumphant melody, later became synonymous with graduation ceremonies around the world. Elgar's reputation as a composer flourished, and he received numerous honors, including a knighthood in 1904 and the Order of Merit in 1911. Despite his successes, he remained a modest and unassuming man, often attributing his achievements to luck rather than his remarkable talent. The First World War deeply affected Elgar, and his later works, like the Cello Concerto, reflected a more introspective and melancholic tone. After the war, he experienced a decline in popularity, but his legacy as a leading figure in British music was already secure. Edward Elgar's contributions to music extended beyond composing. He conducted and performed extensively, both in the UK and abroad, promoting his own works and supporting emerging composers. Elgar's final years were marked by declining health, and he passed away in 1934, leaving behind a vast and enduring musical legacy. His music continues to resonate with audiences worldwide, inspiring generations of musicians and music lovers alike. Today, Edward Elgar remains an integral part of the classical canon, an emblematic figure of British music, and an eternal source of inspiration for aspiring composers around the globe. Well, that's all for today. See you in the next video.